Why the litter box? Have you got a cat? Don't ask. How does a tentacle sit in a beanbag chair? Oh, that part's easy. Getting back out of it is hard. Can you actually use that bowling ball? No, Purple brought that in here after he grew arms. He got really discouraged, though, because he doesn't have fingers. Well, see you later, Green. Yeah! Good luck in saving the world, Bee Man! Uh-oh, this looks like it might work. Good thing he didn't drink that stuff. Neat! Hoagie would really love these. Mmm, plenty of wattage in this stereo. I can't wait to try my 8-tracks in it. There's no label, it's probably blank. you weird Ed Edison, the paramilitary nut? Why, yes, I... Hey, do I know you? Yeah, I'm Bernard Benulli. I broke into your house five years ago, kidnapped your hamster, broke into your piggy bank. Hmm, nope, doesn't ring a bell, but I can't remember much about that period anyway. My psychotherapist thinks something traumatic happened to me back then that I'm blocking out. So you gave up the crazy military commando thing? I'm much better now. I don't have those... those bad thoughts anymore. Now I collect stamps. That's quite a nice collection. Can I have it? No! I mean, uh... No. They mean a lot to me. Sometimes I think they're the only friends I've got. Nice hamster. Does he do tricks? No, he just sits there. I used to have a really smart hamster, but... something... happened to him. What happened to the old hamster? I... I don't remember. When I try, all I can think of is a flash of light and this horrible sound. What was the horrible sound? It was sort of like ding. Oh God, I hear it in my dreams till this day. That hamster really should get some exercise. Well, Dad puts him to work down in the basement sometimes. But then he starts sweating, and then he gets wet, and then he gets cold, and then he refuses to work. Your dad or the hamster? Are you making fun of me? No, I... I get upset when people make fun of me. I just meant... Oh, it makes me so mad. I just want to... Relax. I want to relax. I'll be okay if I just focus on my stamps. Are all your hobbies this fascinating? I don't have any other hobbies. These stamps are my whole life. If anything were ever to happen to them... How are the folks? Well, Dad's in the basement doing an experiment. Mom's in the next room spying on a honeymoon. Ted's in the front yard. Holding up a bowl of lard? Well, it's a bird bath, actually, but it rhymes better your way. 
Well, hope I didn't get you too excited. Bye. Peace be with you. I've got one just like this packed away in the garage. Pony Express stamps. Yes, not the most valuable kind, but they have a lot of sentimental value to me. He's reading the Wall Street Journal. Creepy. Must be an Edison. It's signed, Edna, thanks for giving me the fever. It looks like a physics professor I knew in the second grade. Ooh, baby, what a man. You ain't kidding. I see a large pulsating lump with blue stripes on it. It's Dr. Fred's office. Nothing going on in there. Something strange is going on in there. Boy, she looks even worse than she did five years ago. Excuse me. What is it? I'm rather... Say, aren't you Bernard Bernoulli? Yes, that's right. I knew it! You broke into our mansion a few years ago to save your little friend. What did you come for this time? I'm trying to keep a tentacle from conquering the world. Really? How nice. How's Dr. Fred doing? Well, he's still upset about the family financial situation, seeing that it's his fault and all. But he seems a lot better now that he stopped sleepwalking. How did he wreck the family finances? Well, we should have made millions on the computer game they made about us. But the resident genius locked the contract in the safe in his office and forgot the combination. What's wrong with sleepwalking? Ordinarily, nothing. But when Fred sleepwalks, he remembers the combination to the safe. I find him in the office, opening it, screaming like a cat in the oven, and slamming it again. Something about what's in there really scares him. Unfortunately, I was never able to catch the combination since he works it so fast. How did he manage to stop sleepwalking? He stopped sleeping. Fred drinks a lot of coffee. Me? I only drink decaf. I was just admiring your statue. Thank you. It's been in the Edison family since colonial times. One of Fred's ancestors carved it. This is quite an array of gadgetry you have here. Yes, it's the best surveillance system in the state. Is that a Plexus 7000 VCR? It sure is. It's got a dual tape speed motor with cobalt casing. Don't touch it. Are those xenophobe crystal matrix monitors? They sure are. They're so clear you can see the fleas on the bedroom wall. Don't touch. Do you think I could uh, play with these a bit? Absolutely not. I'll let you get back to what you are doing. Come back any time, you big hunk. <laughs> there doesn't seem to be anything dangerous in there. It's not exactly the Ritz. I can see the roof and some Christmas lights. It's already open. Wow, a pulley. 
By using a combination of flexible materials and a wheel, one may gain mechanical advantage by changing the direction of motion and the applied force. Hmm, a handle attached to a rotating shaft which transmits and modifies rotary motion and torque. There's no flag on it now because it's evening. A shaft is normally attached here to supply a rotary motive force which is transmitted up the pole. Thank you.